Hey everyone, welcome back for a brand new video about that show where you kind of have to kill if you want to survive, The Walking Dead. Warning, beyond this point there are spoilers for people who are not up to date in The Walking Dead television series and the comics. In this video we're going to give you our rampage rankings of our favorite all time survivors. We factored in these characters strengths, weaknesses, how much screen time and growth they've had over the years along with other important details. Who's your favorite survivor? Let's get right into the list. The first survivor on our list was taken from us too soon, The Walking Dead OG, Glenn Reed. Glenn wasn't the toughest in the beginning, but he always had heart and was willing to risk his neck protecting whatever group he was with. Glenn was the spirit of the show for a long time and arguably had the most heart of any character. If Glenn would have survived to the end, he'd be much higher on our list, but he definitely cracks the top 8. Number 2 and a personal favorite of a few members of our team is the one the only... Carl! Carl Grimes started off as a whiny kid and grew into one of our all-time favorite characters. Rick's firstborn had a great sense of empathy and mercy for people that profoundly affected Rick before his own exit from the series. If Carl would have made it to the end like his comic counterpart, we'd probably have him in the top spot. But either way, no TWD list could have our stamp of approval without some Carl on it. The third character probably wouldn't have made our list before season 11, but Rosita Espinosa really picked up the slack in the final season and got herself a glorious ending. Rosita remained in the background for a long time, but every scene she was in, she killed. Rosita deeply affected multiple other major characters and her killing skills were near the top of the pack. There's also huge bonus points for Eugene naming his kid after her and that TWD ends with a new Rosita to honor the original. Number 4 rounds out the bottom half of our list with the former top dog of the saviors, Negan. Negan is a very polarizing character whose entrance is associated with season 7 and 8 which were widely considered the worst seasons by the majority of fans. We don't blame slow writing on a character though and feel that he transformed the landscape of The Walking Dead forever. Whether it's his contributions to All Out War, The Whisperer War, The Reaper Battles, or The Commonwealth Revolution, Negan has almost always been a major player. Although he showed up later in the game than anyone on this list, the former barbed wire, baseball bat, brain bashing bad guy has made a huge difference in the series and helped keep a lot of people alive. The fifth entry on our list is Carol, who opens up the top half. Carol has had one of the biggest arcs of any characters, transforming from a battered housewife to a merciless and highly capable killer. Losing her daughter and adopted son took a huge toll on Carol, but she always managed to get back into a good headspace and make invaluable contributions to the survivors. Remember the wolves? Carol does. Remember Terminus? Carol does. Remember Lance Hornsby? Carol does. Carol may have the highest body count of any character and definitely belongs very high on anyone's TWD list. Number 6 on our list is definitely the best with the sword, Michonne. She entered the show by saving Andrea, but luckily the fans didn't hold that against her. Michonne quickly became a central survivor and Rick's go-to for just about anything. Seriously though, anything. Michonne was extremely important to the main characters and all of the communities she was associated with. Her exit in season 10 was a bummer, but at least we got to see what she was up to in the last scene of the series. With the Rick and Michonne series now in production, we are excited to see the next chapter of their love story and how the Grimes family can once again be whole. The seventh survivor on our list and runner up to the winner is the beast mode master, Rick Grimes. Rick's journey from small town cop to apocalyptic top dog was the reason people watched the show for 9 years straight. His ruthlessness with some enemies and mercy towards others made his character very complex and it made the show so much better. We wish we could understand what happened to Rick in the flagship series but we can't blame his character for that. Rick Grimes will always be a legend and in TWD, second to only one. Before we get into our top pick for TWD characters, we wanted to take a quick second and ask you to bless us and hit that subscribe button. We're expanding our channel in 2023 and would love your help to keep going and making killer content every week. Number 8 on our list is also the winner of our community poll, Daryl Dixon and Dog. They come as a package deal. Daryl has another insane character arc from angry criminal biker to community protector, negotiator, and leader. Daryl wore a lot of hats and picked up the slack when Rick left big time. As each character died or left the show, Daryl was always there to keep this apocalyptic blockbuster banging. The addition of Dog after Rick's exit was truly a masterpiece and we believe Daryl gets extra points for never even having a girlfriend. Rick had a few and he had family, but Daryl turned every survivor into his family and fought his way to the top of our Rampage rankings. For honorable mentions, we have King Ezekiel who came pretty late in the game along with Morgan and Maggie who both left the series at kind of crucial moments. The team was very divided on Maggie. What do you think? Who should have been in our top 8? Who is the strongest survivor? Should we have given Dog his own slot? Thanks so much for watching our videos everyone! As always, we're on the lookout for any new spin-off promo videos or insider information to help prove or disprove all the rumors and theories out there about our favorite show that just went to spin-off heaven, The Walking Dead. Please let us know your thoughts in the comment section below. Follow us on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, and TikTok at Binge Rampage. Click that notifications bell for our channel so you can see our next video as soon as it comes out and don't forget to subscribe. We were walking side by side but you were bringing me somewhere. 
bringing me here, bringing all of us to the new world.